When our learners come to the high school, I think the major change that they see is that ability for options. Now they have the opportunity to look at those styles of learning, rates of learning, where they want to learn, uh, and they can put that into practice with an online class, a self-paced class, the Apollo program, uh, or a traditional, I mean, it, or a combination of all of those. Coming to the high school really um, is that culminating event with their mass customized learning experience where now they can see all those different options, know what serves them best, and then apply that to uh, the courses that they take here. Two or three years ago, when a learner would have a, a bright idea of something that they wanted to do totally different than other learners, as a teacher, um, we all struggled with, well, where do I fit that in? Um, how do I make time to allow that to happen? Now, I'm taking five classes, and I love learning, and it's all because I learned my specific way of learning, and that excites me. And that is mass customized learning. You know what kind of learning you want to do, and that's great, now go do it. I literally put a piece of paper in front of them and said, what would you like to do? And they brainstormed and we built it from there. Well, we had a lot of freedom. She practically said we could take it in any direction we wanted it to be. So she was really supportive. I just really enjoy like having to, like problem solve to work out all like the challenges we faced in our business. I've realized that you don't need all academic classes to get a learning experience. This is kind of um, a class that encompasses all the other classes. By giving the students choice, I really think it's letting them learn what they want to learn and they can take it so much further because they're really interested in it. And really, I let them run with it. If they wanted to do a certain type of project, that's what we did. So that was kind of how it all came about. We were trying to offer some flexibility and letting those learners that want to excel and go fast, go fast, and those learners that needed extra time, they could take extra time. By having those students all together with me at one time for the demo lesson, then the breakout students, the ones who don't really need my help, I don't really see much the rest of the week. They might email me or stop in for a question. But those who are struggling or who need more advanced help, they can come in and see me on a day-to-day -day basis. Whereas before, I was lucky to see those students for like five or 10 minutes per person because you have a large class. And now I might be able to spend 50, 60 minutes with just that group and really kind of help them advance their learning. I've always been a very curious person, but I've always had to press those curiosities and kind of put them to the side for the moment so that I could focus on the actual things that were being graded in class. I couldn't look more in depth into it because I knew I had a time restraint where I had to have this assignment due tomorrow and I couldn't take that time to look into it more. So I kind of repressed all those curiosities and then when I got into Apollo, I kind of started digging them back up. So it's kind of got in touch with my child-like self again. So it was fun to learn. You can kind of decide what you want to learn, but also how you want to learn it and how you want to show that you've learned it. it gave me the opportunity to actually look into it and actually start songwriting and, and doing what I love on a daily basis and just letting my most imaginative parts of myself free, you know? Like, it made me become the person that I wanted to become all this time. You get the chance to sit down one-on-one -on -one with each of these teachers and ask them questions, let them figure out who you are and how best to help you. And in the end, you get this bond that you could never have with traditional teaching. What I kind of like is the content's still there, but there are definitely other skills that have come to the forefront that they're utilizing from day one even to now. The whole point was for these teachers to see these students excel in a different way that they don't have the option to in other classes. And it made me realize how much I want to help promote education. Now there's more conversation than ever between those teachers 
all in the name of helping our learners, all in the name of truly understanding where children are to best meet their needs. That helps us get to the root of customizing the educational experience.